Question eight. Minji, yes. you said also it's very famous, the beer lovers. You need to add a word. It's very famous with beer lovers, or you can say amongst. 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 A M O N G S T. A M O. Actually, if you say among beer, lo beer lovers, that's also okay. The difference between among and amongst is uh, not that important. Uh, you said, I travel Sapporo in this summer. You would say, I traveled to Sapporo in this summer. I would drop the word in. Just, I traveled to Sapporo this summer. In the summer. This summer. In the summer. Yeah. Sapporo, you can eat very cheap. You do not eat beer. Mm. You cannot say that. Drink beer. You, Sapporo, you can drink very cheap. You can drink okay. it. Or you can just say, it's very cheap. It's right? Very cheap. It's very cheap. Um, it's very cheap. And then you said, very crowded people. You have to choose. It's very crowded. Or crowded with people. But even if you say crowded with people, it's okay. It's a little bit repetitive. Mm. Just crowded. June, you said the weight of alcohol. We always say alcohol content, 4.5. Also, there's some letter. B, B, V, I, B, V, I forget. B, V, I? B, V, I. It's talking about alcohol content. There is an abbreviation that they always use. I forget the letters. <laughs> alcohol content. Also, there's something called proof, but that is more used for strong liquor. If something is 80 proof, it is 40% alcohol. I don't know why they do it, just double. A lot of times you can see some whiskey or might be 90 proof, 45% alcohol. There was one in college that many people know about. It's called Bacardi 181, meaning Bacardi 181 proof. It is 90% alcohol. Oh. <laughs> Just oh. if you drink, it's, I, you should not <laughs> drink shot. But I'm, many college students, because they're stupid, they would drink maybe two or three shots of Bacardi 181, and you're, oh. you're fucked, basically, like, done. But it, it's all, you can also use to mix, for a mixed drink. But it's called Bacardi 181, 90% alcohol. <laughs> I had it one time. Oh, one time, oh. <laughs> and then went to the bar or club or something. Uh, you said, I feel like I am gaining my weight. Take off the word my, I feel like I am gaining weight. Gaining weight. And then you, I could not understand what you said. I pick the decent or decent. Did you mean to, uh, yeah, uh, decent? decent I pick the decent restaurant. I pick a decent restaurant, a decent place, a decent restaurant. And then you said the money meet the target. I would say once the target is reached, uh, you don't really need to use the word money. The money doesn't meet the target. The target is reached like that. Once the target is reached, blah, blah, blah. Once we reach our target, blah, blah, blah. Johnny, you said shit man one, each other, each, no other. This, if we pay it, it is $100 each. No other. Last week I a business trip, you need a verb. Last week I took a business trip is quite common. You can also say went on a business trip. Uh, you said they need to some money. They need to some money. Maybe you are missing the verb, they need to raise some money. Or you can just leave, out, leave it out and say they need some money. They need some money. They need to raise some money. It's both are okay. Uh, I think you've said this one be before, or someone else said it. We are failure. Uh, we are failure. You would say we are a failure, but that is quite. Uh, it's not that common to say that we are a failure. That is more emphasizing. Oh, we're horrible. We are a failure. It's really like meaning kind of all around, all aspects, you know. Usually you just say we failed as a verb, right? And then you say, oh, about the cafe, some part is crashed. It's okay to say that, but 
I would probably say falling down, falling apart. There's a really uh, Im impressive word you could use, dilapidated. <laughs> dilapidated. It's really talking about like buildings and stuff like that. If you say crashed, it sounds like there was maybe some accident or something like that. So I would say simply, some parts are falling down, falling apart probably is better. Or if you want to use a very big, difficult word, dilapidated. Sun mean, my main problem in these days, no in, just say my main problem these days. When you say these days, you don't use the word in. Then you said people, ba people barely betrayed me. If you say barely betrayed me, it sounds like they barely <laughs> betrayed you. You could say they people barely ever betrayed me. Or you could say not many people betrayed me. The way you said it makes it sound like it happened, but very, to a very small degree. Uh, in my point of view, we usually say from my point of view. And you said visited a cafeteria. I'm almost positive you meant cafe, not cafeteria. Cafeteria is like food court. School cafeteria. Also some hospital cafeteria. Some business place might have a, a cafeteria, but it's probably more common to call it food court. But cafeteria, especially school and hospital. School, especially school, it's always called the cafeteria, you know, with your tray, and you take that, and you take that. And Jungmin, you said, I had a party for end of year. I would just say, I had an end of year party. It sounds much better. Um, I had an end of year party. You could say, I had a party to celebrate the end of the year, but just easier. I had an end of year party. He doesn't have a uh, money, no a. Uh. Right? He doesn't have money. You said outgoing, the owner. I think you were talking about the owner of Brewdog or someone. You said outgoing. I think I wrote down... Active. What? Active. Active? I thought you might mean out there or eccentric. When I described the owner, right? He's very strange, kind of out there. Eccentric out there. Outgoing just means, oh, I like to meet people, I'm very friendly. Outgoing is very different. And then you said, uh, even the company was a fail, you got back the money. I would just change the order and add the word though. Even though, even though the company failed, like I said, not was a fail, even though the company failed, you got your money back. Not you got back the money. It's always strange to say the money. It's okay, but you got back your money. 